EA Sports live coverage of the top of Europe. Today it's Paris Saint-Germain against Hartlepool United. Of course, the game being played under lights this evening. So without further ado, we're off to Paris. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hello everyone, Martin Tyler here, Alan Smith is with me. A warm welcome to you for this Copa Europe match. Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how this one develops because it's surprised that uh, all the clubs are serious about this year. Hartlepool United, they were happy with what happened in their last game. It was away from home. They could only draw, although they looked like being winners for a period of the game. It was against Chelsea. Yeah, the 2-2 draw had uh, lots to recommend it, but from a defensive point of view, not good enough. I think they're going to lose. Paris Saint-Germain, this is their lineup. see why they wanted to sign him an excellent uh, performance that has put the other players under pressure now for this game really impressive the way he's taken to his new club he's shown a lot of confidence and authority Ludger Falk is the referee today well, this is the reward really for success in Europe's major competitions over the previous season playing for the copper he's got space got to be oh it's in there And that's what you call unstoppable. Hit with power. Hit into the bottom right hand corner. It's a goal worth looking at again, isn't it? So after the goal, we've opened the scoring here. 1 0. Ramirez. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. And he takes the shot. Good, strong challenge. Here the challenge is a good one. danger to the goal has gone with that clearance Ramirez a timely challenge now he can cross it it's an excellent break here because he's got support here's the cross It's not really going to get the better of him from that range, especially when he can see it all the way. And it's going to be a, a throw here. Excellent positioning, and the interception is made. Tweedy. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. And the ball's gone again. Baratti. corner coming up to Paris Saint-Germain where a goal down here's a replay again of the goal good strong tackle Pope This could be a chance. He's one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. 
instant judgment and movement by the goalkeeper well his starting position was very good and he showed a nice bit of pace to get out there it's good vision to be able to switch the play there a lot of financial resources behind this team Paris Saint-Germain at the moment the backers will be thinking that maybe they backed a loser here because the scoreline tells you they are behind and the shape of the game tells you that unless they improve they're going to really struggle in the second half as well Pope He might be through, in with a chance, tried to get it up high and back down again, but didn't quite get the elevation. One of the most difficult skills. That's half-time in the Copa Europe, and not much between the two sides here. We're dealing with slender margins, I think, today. We are. We've got two good defences here. We're into now the second half of this clash for the Copa Europe. A decent first half, but I think there's more to come from these two teams. Close got to be. I don't think he was quite sure where the goal was as he took the shot on. Ramirez. Baratti. Chance to cross it. Cross it. Cross that had to be dealt with. Made the challenge well. Oh, and goes across. Aubameyang couldn't put it onto the target. Oh, and look, he's lost his marker and he's done ever so well to do that, but that final bit was eluding him. Very good tackle. Ramirez, Griezmann, Gaston Ramirez. Here's the chance, and they've scored the equaliser. Well, we're back at level pegging again at 1-1. It's a free kick here in a scoring position, there's no doubt about that. That's going to be a yellow card for this player. You can't have any complaints. Plenty of ooze from the crowd, but I think the goalkeeper had a shot. It was a vicious try. Yeah, it was, and perhaps a little bit greedy, a bit selfish as well. Amis supporters, je vous rappelle que des toilettes sont à votre disposition un peu partout dans le stade. N'hésitez pas à demander un steward pour en connaître l'emplacement. Good play, one on one. Merci. Showing it's a physical game when it's a fair one too, and that's a great challenge. Coutinho. PSG know that the clock is against them. Well, those defenders are going to be asked to head the ball. Quite a lot, I think. Plenty of aerial balls are going to be coming their way in the next few moments. Sharply done to restart it here. Here's the cross. And he really went for that and got his fist to it. goes the cross it's a defender's ball and the tackle there is successfully done
on the attack here. Keeper away, a good punch here. Gonna cross it. And this is gonna be a throw. And this is where you earn in with the chance. Keeper's done very well here. So this is going to be a corner for Paris Saint-Germain. What can they do with it now? David Luiz! Aurier. Beavers. Et on jouera 5 minutes de temps additionnel. That will be a free kick. Simple decision for the referee. Free kick, yellow card. Yeah, everybody moves up. That's definitely yellow. Great opportunity. Got to be. Tries the volley. Well, he got it all wrong in the end with the opportunity to put his team in front. Oh. You want a chance to go ahead. You want that kind of chance. The coaches have had their say. Both teams back on their feet. They were looking rather tired as we waited for extra time, which now begins. Doris is the goalkeeper. Gaston Ramirez. Ramirez. Good work from the defender then, who was really challenged by the quality of the ball that he had to deal with. Baratti. That's the way to win the ball back. We could be in. In he goes on goal. Here's the chance. Back into play off the crossbar. Oh no, an own goal. And at this stage too. Oh, what a shocking moment for the player. Look at him, he's distraught. That own goal has come at the worst possible time. decides he's going to make a change it's been a really good match this and we've reached the end of the first half of extra time We now know what's left, 15 minutes of extra time. It's a quick break. Look at the space he's got. In with a chance. Went for the lob. Well, the goalkeeper was able to reach back and keep it out. Well, when they come off, they look spectacular, but the keeper was having none of it there. Well, the keeper might want to go forward himself, but he's sending his teammates up the field. Tackling is a real skill. Oh, he's through. Oh, can you believe it? It is a penalty. And the goalkeeper has got a yellow card here. He could have been sent off. He scores from the spot. Just a play.
race it down the middle that and see the keeper going the wrong way. Really good. And the scoreline is 3-1. This could be a chance. Oh, it's a clear chance. And that'll just run back to the goalkeeper. He can pick it up. Et on jouera deux minutes de temps additionnel. could be it got to be and you'll see again here what wonderful work it was by Loris in this one and there we are the referee has brought a halt finally after a terrific game that's gone into extra time uh, it's a good way to get some early season silverware here in the Copa Europa which we've enjoyed watching Alan and uh, I think a deserved success. I think it was. I mean, there's been some uh, terrific skill shown. The, the standards set were high and uh, bodes well for their season. You've said it often before, Alan, you, you can't take for granted you'll ever win anything again. So when you do get a winner's medal, as they're getting here and celebrating, just drink it in, milk the moment. It's easy to think that the good times will keep on a rolling, but that's not always the case. And I think these players appreciate that. It's been a brilliant occasion. All credit to the organisers for the way it's staged. It sets it up. It makes it... Copper Europe. Paris Saint-Germain, one. Hartlepool United, three after extra time. Let's look at the draw of the English League Cup. Arsenal entertain Blackburn Rovers. Hartlepool United host Queen's Park Rangers. Swansea City are at home to Manchester United. Leicester City entertain Tottenham Hotspur. Charlton Athletic host Manchester City. Liverpool are at home to Brentford. Southampton entertain Millwall. Meanwhile, Wolverhampton Wanderers host Leeds United.